Hi, I'm Chris from ICOM UK, and today I'd like to introduce you to our new VHF radio, the M510. The first thing you can notice with the radio in shot is a full color display and also a departure on the styling as well from our previous radios. So it has a full color TFT display, super wide angle viewing as well, so that's 180 degrees viewing angle. So although it's a full color TFT display, you have no compromise on usability or visibility. The radio also has a nighttime mode, so perfectly viewable in both daylight, bright sunlight, and it's got a really nice adjustable backlight for night vision as well. But perhaps the most important exciting development in the 510 is the ability to connect to your mobile phone. So this is a real revelation or revolution in VHF design, especially for ICOM. So the radio is wireless over LAN. It allows you to connect up to three mobile phones using the radio as the hub. So you've got full VHF control by phone and you've also got intercom between phones as well. However, the radio still does come with a traditional fist mic with both the ability to plug into the front of the radio and also into the rear of the radio. More and more now for cosmetics and high-end power boats, etc., they want to do away with the ability, you know, with the necess necessity rather to have a curly cable coming out the front of the radio. They want it nice clear lines and no, no unsightly cables. So you can actually rear mic the mic, have it mounted either to the port or to the starboard and you've got the mic to fall back on but you've also got uh, mobile phone um, ability to operate the radio as well. So let's have a look at the radio in a little bit more detail. As mentioned earlier the styling is a pretty dramatic departure for us. It's a really cosmetically pleasing radio. It's super thin. And let's just have a look at the back of the radio as well. We mentioned earlier that you can have the rear mic, uh, rear mic option. So you've got a socket for rear mic, but also a socket for command mic interfaces as well. A command mic is ICOM terminology for a dual station. It's a, it's a handheld second station, a very sophisticated, repeats everything the radio, uh, the radio itself does. M510 has retained ICOM's very intuitive user interface. So let's just go through a function. I'm going to take the backlight from day mode into night mode. First thing you do, press the menu, up and down here, go to settings, press enter, configuration, press enter, backlight, press enter, and then you go down into day mode or night mode, switch on to night mode, press enter, and then channel 16 is a quick way of taking you back to the front level menu. Also available for the M510 is the CT-M500. This little interface box here. This allows uh, extra connectivity for the 510, such as um, connecting to a um, hailer, a hailer horn, or if you need to expand the system upwards to NMEA 2000 as well. So in conclusion, we're looking to launch the uh, M510 in September this year. We're booked to do Southampton Boat Show. Hopefully it goes ahead. We like to launch a product in the traditional method to the public at a boat show. I hope you agree. This is a beautifully engineered radio. We've had a good old play with it now. We've got a demo. We've had this demo unit in the ICOM UK office. We put it through its uh, paces. Uh, the engineers think it's fantastic. We're very, very pleased with it. IPX7 front fascia, so no compromise, although it's beautifully engineered, lovely colour display, it's a rugged radio as well. We feel it should fulfil a lot of different places in the market, from your small um, work boats, ribs, through to the high-end leisure sector as well.